Hey guys, how's it going? Daniel here and today we're checking out an awesome app that I really enjoy using on the iPhone and that app is called Sticky Widgets. So recently the developer this week released Sticky Widgets 3.0 and what's new in 3.0? Well, let's check it out. So one of the big things of course is now my favorite thing is now it supports list. So now you can add a list on your on your stickies on your home screen. So how it works is pretty simple. So when you create a new sticky, you have now the option right here that allows you to create it into a list automatically without you having to do, do anything really. So you could just start adding whatever you need. So if you need to add, just click right here and just add apples, uh, oops, milk, oops, seeds, there we go. And you just keep adding whatever you want and then oranges. And then from there, when you're done, you just click done. And then from there, you have a list that you created uh, right within the app. And then from here, I'm going to just delete this one. So we're going to click done. Now, there's another neat little feature. It's called a note ID, which of course is not new. This has been already on the app before, but now there's a, a, a new feature within note ID which allows you to customize the note ID to make it easier to find this sticky widget to add it to your widget on your home screen. So now you can just click on here and just click um, food list, save. And then from there, you just cl click here, add a widget and food list right there. Oops, it's already done. And there we go. So I don't have to do anything because I already had it customized before in this video. But yeah, it's just a really, really cool up update, of course. And then if you go into like the medium sized widget, which I have right here for an example, it has two extra buttons. So now it has an add, so which allows you to add another item to your list or the other application just opens up the list so you could just read it and see what you're missing uh, when you're going out to the groceries or just going out to the store to buy stuff. You can see your list right within the app. So yeah, it's just a really, really fantastic update. Now the application also, if you're a, you know, if you're into shortcuts and iOS and everything, the app now does support shortcuts as well. Um, I'm not really into the shortcuts world yet in iOS, but it's really cool since I played around with the course with shortcuts and see what it's capable of. And it's just really neat that the developer did integrate shortcuts with uh, sticky widgets as well. So that's pretty much it for what's new in the application. The app is still free. You can go and download it right now in the app store. There is an in-app purchase, which of course unlocks customization. Also, you can change colors, fonts, um, and just play around with the different designs for your sticky widgets on your home screen. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys did enjoy this mini review video of sticky widgets, it'll mean the world to me that you'll hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, and comment below on what apps you want me to check out for you guys and what type of videos you guys want to see in the future. Other than that, I will see you guys later. Peace.